It's an absolutely beautiful day and me and Izzy have popped into Cardiff Centre. Look at these beautiful hanging baskets. They're looking especially lovely at the moment. Made it to Wilco's. What have you found, Izzy? Look at this little cutie ball. <laughs> I love it. <laughs> getting totally distracted from our clothes by mission I am desperate for vests and t-shirts we've had a bit of a summer of it we had a bit of a plumbing issue which involved needing to replace the entire original water main so our whole summer holiday has just been us like this uh, waiting for plumbers to ring and turn up and stuff it's been really boring and we haven't had water for a week it's back on now but it was off for a week still have no cold water only hot water so I can't run the washing machine so I'm literally out of clothes, just swerving to avoid toddler. <laughs> what is the? So I'm going to try TK Maxx. Oh no, she's seen the giant donut. Are you quite happy in there? <laughs> I've been in here two seconds and I'm brain dead. Already, I just looked around, there's loads and loads of clothes. I don't know, I just, just want a plain one. It's all like, like, I don't know how to pattern it. Mum just wants to play. <laughs> it's her swag style. I think I'm confused, like, because they're all different. It's too much choice. I need a row with lots of things the same. This one didn't look too bad. It's kind of relatively just plain, but... Dun, dun, dun. Horrible thing at back. Why would I want to wear that? I'm not doing very well with the whole bind me clothes thing, but what have you found? This lovely skirt. How does it look? It goes really well with these shoes. I love. I couldn't stand it. That was sensory overload in there. She has now got two items and I have nothing. This is not good. I'm going to try H&M next. Izzy has saved the day. She found me some plain t-shirts in H&M. Thank I God. Do. I was wandering around in a total daze. So I was like in the knickers section because I was just listening to the music and like, it's like this. Oh, why am I in here? Kind of like that. And then Izzy came and took charge. I found them straight away. Here they are. Just plain, no logos, no pockets. Just plain t-shirts. So of course, I am bulk buying them. Okay, so that is mission accomplished for the three t-shirts that I now own. That'll do me. Not a fan of clothes shopping, gotta be honest. It's all a bit like overwhelming. <laughs> so we're gonna go and see if Nata and Co Bakery is open now and have a drink and a snack. Down we go. Izzy's gone in Hamley's toy shop over there and I'm just sitting on a bench. I think I'm going to learn some Spanish on my phone or something. Someone's back. You finished? Yes. Should we go eat? No, oh, I'm hungry. Good. Let's do it. I'm hungry. We're heading through St. David's Centre now. I'm recovering from the clothes shop in days. Now I've sat and done Spanish for five minutes. Sorted my head out. Oh yeah. Just got given free LucasAid. Won't complain. Not very healthy. Probably not the best thing for a child full of caffeine. But she is 12, I suppose. Great news, Isabel does not like LucasAid. It's not her thing. Good, that's one less unhealthy thing to have to argue about. I took one sip and I was like, oh. <laughs> Gross. It says LucasAid original on it, but actually it's full of artificial sweeteners now. <laughs> I had a feeling these were going to be a bit of a passing fad. Look, they're already on, the, on bog off. What do you think of the fidget spinner craze, Izzy? I still like them. Yeah? If I, did, if I wasn't going to like consistently like it for ages, I would have bought one. Probably. Even I've got one. <laughs> oh, it's a tremendous stink by it. It smells of bins. It must be the hot weather, I think. <laughs> got a brioche de vegetage, and it's very nice. And a cappuccino. It was super crowded in here for ages, but a load of people have gone out now. This is scoffing a brie and ham type sandwich, which did have rocket in, but she's removed all the rocket. 
That was yummy. We're heading to the station now via a shop because Isabel's persuaded me to let her have sweets. What's that smell? More bin smells. Ugh. It's like we're reliving the great... Mummy, you're pointing the camera so it's not on me. I didn't. It's like we're reliving the great stink or the big stink in Victorian times. Remember that? Yes. Yes, we're really living that because there's always a bin as well, sir. It's okay, the van of stink is disappearing now. It was a, a bin van thingy that was, someone was going around emptying all the bins into it. That was the source of the pong. So we're all right. We can unplug our noses. Yeah, no more call for public health reforms just yet. Not it's all right. Yet. I think there must be some sort of pop concert on or something in the Millennium Stadium because we can we can hear it <laughs> and it's gone from being very very busy in town to very quiet all of a sudden so maybe they've all filtered into there oh no look at the poor man some swine has put a lighter on his crotch that building's coming on over there the sweets have been procured from the spa or somewhere in the end they didn't have them in Sainsbury's we're just going to see if this way to the station is now clear. And it is. That's good. Look how the building's getting on. Last time we vlogged around here, it was still very much in the construction <laughs> stage. I'm sure it's far from finished, but it's, it's looking a lot more complete now. Got about 10 minutes to wait for our train. <laughs> It's like announcement overload. Coming from all directions in various languages. Well, Welsh and English. They were both English. Were they? Yeah. Well, there's one Welsh one just now as well. Okay, so that's our train up there. But it's just stopped. It's teasing us. Said train has finally stopped teasing us, and here it is sitting at Cardiff Central Station. And we're off now to go back to my dad's house. We're staying there tonight. We're off to a party this evening, that should be fun. My dad's now. Izzy and Grandad are playing cards. What game are you playing, Izzy? Rummy. Oh yeah, how are you doing? Well, you're sorted, we don't know yet. Oh, sorry, well, I don't know. So we're off out again in about half an hour. We've been in a while actually, just chilling out before we head off to our party. So, just having a cup of tea before I go. Thanks for hanging out with us today. I'll see you next time, bye. Oh, look at that bird up there. What are you doing? Trying to eat something. 